بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو میک دا اسکور کارڈس ان آور پروفٹ اینڈ لاس رپورٹ وتھ دا فالوئنگ انفارمیشن لائک دا ایبسولوٹ ویلیو آف دا کرنٹ پیریڈ اینڈ دا کمپیریزن آف دا لاسٹ پیریڈ اینڈ دا کمپیریزن آف دا پریویس ایئر ڈیٹا لیٹ سی ہاؤ وی کین کریٹ دیز بیوٹیفل اسکور کارڈس ان آور رپورٹ So this is our report which we have created in our last lecture. Let's go to the edit, go to the scorecard, drag it here. Once you drag it, you will see here the value. This value comes from the period from January 1, 2019 to February 29. And we need this value for the current month, not for the whole year. Let's see how we can do this. We will make this scorecard for the revenue scorecard. We will drag here the revenue in the metric. Okay. Then we will choose the custom default date range, which will be our last month. Like 2020 February, the 1st February to 29 February. We will apply here. This is data for the February only. We will make the style. We need the compact numbers like in thousands. And what we will need to do, we need to hide the metric name. Okay. Now we need to make a comparison with the previous month previous period which will be the 29 days of the last month if the february was for the 29 days if we are selecting here the previous period we will get the data for only 29 days comparison of the last month you can choose here whole month there will be no issue so we will make here apply and you can see the previous month data we will go to the data style and we will unchoose here hide comparison as you can see from previous 29 days this is the comparison of this data let's copy this and paste here and we will make here the comparison of previous year previous year from february 2019 in first to 28 february apply here we will be having a data here go to orange and order and send to back okay cool now we need to create a text here revenue select change to the dark blue change the font size okay bold make it bold and border should be white and outline will be dark blue okay drag it to the here and go to arrange order and send it back you can see here our revenue chart revenue scorecard is ready we can arrange this anywhere here copy this paste to make the expense scorecard copy this paste to make the profit net profit scorecard copy this and paste to the net profit scorecard okay now here we will make a 
expense. Here we will make net profit. Here we will make the net profit margin. Okay. Now what we need to do here, we need to select the metric here, expense, and the other data will be same. The comparison, we need to select here the metric expense. Okay, this is ready. As you can see here, the arrows are going increase in expense should be in red because expenses, if increased, these are not favorable figure. What we will do, we will go to the style. The positive figure for the expense will be red and the negative figure will be in green. Okay. See here, the positive figure will be red and the negative figure will be green. Now it's good. Go to the net profit and data profit here also profit okay net profit margin we need to change the metric here net profit margin here also net profit margin net profit margin is already in percentages what we need to do here we need to change the style to show absolute change see here show absolute change very nice this is what we have done these are the scorecards as much as you can create the scorecards in our report this is the best way to create them thank you very much